ranked teams. And then a lot of it goes with how quickly can they get Quinn Post off. But you, you're going to find Virginia to probably double him. And then how about his supporting cast tonight? Vanderplot, shot clock down to five. And a nice move inside, but a better tip by Jaden Gardner. Talk about how his team is mature. And then obviously having Quinton Post has given him a lot of freedom. You see the guy Ashton Langford come and knock that shot down. Up top, it's McLaughlin. Now into Post. Too strong off the glass. Offensive stick back for the big man. Under the basket near the baseline. 4-4, B.C. Looking to take the lead, and a leg bay nets the three-pointer. And that's one of the things for Boston College. Ashton Langford gets it inside the post. He got behind Vanderplas. The pass was a perfect one. Eagles playing well. And how about this one from seven-footer Quentin Post. Takes it home, 9-6 Eagles. Seekman gets to the paint. Gardner spin move. Around the rim and in. And that's where Gardner's at his best. Virginia basketball out of the timeout. Zachary had that BC foul as we went to timeout. Kihei Clark nailing his first shot of the night. Also, Chaz Kelly, there's double zero and a turnover. In the ball game, Shedrick lays it in. How about Shedrick being able to come up, big man? Cavaliers capture the lead at 11 to 9. Post. Virginia bringing that double immediately and driving to the basket. What a nice pass out of the double team. Here at home in conference play, 4-4. Four four. Five on the shot clock. Gardner. That's eight early for Jade. Kelly, five on the shot clock. Manson, baseline, jumper is good. And the ball moves from east to west. Three seconds on the shot clock. And from the baseline, Bickerstaff delivers. McNeely gives it up on the drive. Big man gets it to go. And that's the guy from Virginia, I think, that has the ability to break down his man. Post. It's the cutter. Nice weak side action for a lay-in by McGlock. To the wing, Kelly. Short hop of the rebound. Zachary. How about Jaden Zachary? And we, again, Earl Grant talked about the scrappiness. Going the F extra effort and win the 50-50 balls. McNeely throws it away. The bump, the lay-in is good. Ashton Langford's got four now. Gardner, tough shot, swatted away. Second chance for the Cavs. Franklin dives to the hole. Nice finish by Amon Franklin. Langford in the corner. Fifth Virginia turnover. Nice pass inside. The land is good. And again, you see Quinn Post recognizing and accepting the double team. The floor. So again, like you said, very athletic and finish at the rim. Clark, the bump, and the bank. Nice penetration by Kihei Clark. And again, time and time again. Back out to Clark. Switched against the big. They revisit Gardner for the turnaround at the end of the clock. And again, you see that he had a, a much smaller Jaden Zachary on. But if you're, if you're Quinn Post, you've got to go ahead and attack the middle. And I think he's taking way too long. You see on the other end, great block. Terrific block by McLaughlin. Could not develop a pick and roll, so back to the wing goes Zachary. He rolls it in. Zachary realizes he's got a, a small, a slightly smaller <laughs> yeah. Kihei Clark. He stuck with him. Some coaches hit the panic button and get him out of the game. But, but he didn't. And it led, I thought, to Post's confidence. And then he shot the ball so well. Danton Langford driving and laying it in. And it's turning into points on the other end. Beekman. <laughs> well, you just feel the pressure mounting. But Virginia comes up with a steal. Beekman gets it off and scores. And that's a rough play. Into the second hand. They revisit one post. Oh, that, that didn't get a flop warning, but it could have. Whenever they do get to the rim, they're being met by challenges at the rim. Boston College doing a good job of being able to, to get there. You see the post. And it puts a floater. But here's the thing, though. Post in the middle. Dumps it off to Zachary. And, and here's the thing. What made that play? Quinn Post coming in, but got it over to Zachary wide open. 
Boston College got a nice little offensive rhythm going. And the freshman Isaac McNeely when they needed him the most. They played for the polka dots. Is ready to go in Boston. 38-28 on the lob. The lane is good. DeMar Langford's got six. Exactly. McNeely again. Good again. Back-to-back -back bombs by the freshman from West Virginia. On the bench because, again, this team has not found any kind of offensive rhythm, as I say. James Zachary says, Brian Oliver, you call me tomorrow. <laughs> Done. Clark dumps it off late. Gardner. Jaden's up to 14 now. In this league, so I like that look. A post. Vanderplas inside. Gardner connects again. 16 points for Jaden. Halts the dribble. 10 on the shot clock. Zachary in the paint. Oh, oh. it just hit it over the rim. How about that penetration by, by Zachary? But Virginia was making that comeback. BC answers. Zachary for three. Yes. Oh, talking about feeling it. Jaden Zachary is like, you know what? We need a spot. We need someone to give us a little bit of a lift. Feeds it inside. Vanderplas. Good look to find Beekman. Nothing develops. Now Gardner. Vanderplas. Baseline. Got it. Big Ben averages close to eight a game. His first two tonight. 49-39. Ashton Langford hits the breaking fresh by the leg bay and he jams it. And Bob Hill will tell you that that play was set up by Ashton Langford. Vanderplas going to work. And one. Nice move by Vanderplas. I love the fact that Virginia. And these possessions for Virginia taking time off that clock. The lane is good for UVA's Armand Franklin. Just his second field goal. Zachary. Follow. Good by McLaughlin. Great follow up by McLaughlin again. Defense is so preoccupied with Jaden Zachary. Cover is Langford. He'll go in and oh, score. There's his defense a little bit to make sure that he makes Virginia run some clock and not give him any early easy looks. Vanderplas hits the three. Trying to keep hope alive here for the Cavaliers. Virginia to, to defend and then try to get in under 10 seconds. Ashton Langford. What a night for Boston College. Eighth, excuse me, eighth conference game. That's it. Ball game. 63-46. Clark steps in. Hits it with six seconds. 63-48 to mid-court Zachary. He holds on to it. It's all over. Court's time and Chestnut Hill.